The Super Bowl is here and about half of America or 100 to 200 million people have their eyeballs on one event. So with that much attention, here are six ways you can make $10,000 from the Super Bowl. And the best part is that you could do this no matter where you live. Although if you're in Glendale, Arizona, you can clean up. All right, now the first way is to live stream the game. Okay, now don't live stream the actual game, but live stream yourself watching the game. Every year there are so many live streams of people's reactions of certain plays of the game, whether you're a fan of certain teams. Every year there are so many live streams that get hundreds of thousands of views. And all you need is your iPhone or a laptop. You can go live on Instagram, YouTube, and also Twitch, and you can make money off of every single view. You can make money off of the ads being played on your videos. You can make money by selling merch. You can make money by getting tips. You could sell merchandise right in the description. There are so many ways, and having a lot of eyeballs on you is the perfect opportunity to make a massive amount of money. You can get paid $200 an hour to watch the Super Bowl. Now, every year, Ozpedia offers any football fan their dream job, and they pay a generous $200 per hour uh, with the entire coverage of the NFL Super Bowl being five hours. And the best part is that they throw in an extra $100 for snacks. Now, what you'll be doing is under their jobs responsibilities is you will take notes and collect data. Now, what you will be taking notes for is stuff like, was the coin flip heads or tails? Did the national anthem time go over or was it under? What was Rihanna's first song at the halftime show? And what was the color of the Gatorade that was poured on the coach's head? They will be accepting applications all the way up to Wednesday, February 8th and they will be announcing the, the winner, whoever gets the job on Friday, February 10th. All right, now the second way where you can make money off of the Super Bowl is to set up a cleaning service. Pretty much every other household is gonna have a Super Bowl party and a lot of them don't wanna clean up after. So it doesn't matter what city you're in, what state, what country, people are gonna be looking for cleaning services to clean up after the game. Now this was very popular last year. I know the party that I went to, a cleaning service came in and cleaned up after. So the demand is there, you just need to get in front of the customer. Now, certain ways where you can advertise, uh, you could do Google AdWords, you get $100 for free, so you could you could take advantage of that. I don't know if they're still having that promotion, but definitely look that up. It might be $75 if you spend 25. So look that up. You could also advertise on Nextdoor, which is a very underrated social media platform for local services. You could create a profile on TaskRabbit. You could do you could do a Craigslist ad. There are there are so many different platforms out there. Now looking through quotes myself on the cleaning service, they range from anywhere from 500 all the way to 1000. Uh, it's the Super Bowl bump. So, if you uh if you have a cleaning service for $500, all you need to do is clean 20 houses and you made 10 grand. Isn't that fantastic? All right, now the third creative way that you can make money off the Super Bowl is to drive for Uber Eats. Now, this is the only one on there where I don't think $10,000 is attainable, but $1,000 for the day is definitely attainable. If you drive for big holidays where people just aren't working, like New Year's Eve, like Halloween, and also the Super Bowl, you get some pretty amazing orders. Now, if you've never driven for Uber Eats before, I did a video which you can check out uh, just so you can get an idea of uh, what to expect and what to do. And check out the link in the description because you get paid a minimum per like the first 50 or 75 rides. So just, just check that out. Check out that video if you've never driven before. And let's move on to the next one. All right, now the fourth and uh, probably the most creative is that you can sell digital assets on Etsy specifically for the Super Bowl. Now, I'm not saying copy any of these, but you can use this as inspiration. But if you scroll, uh, you can see a lot of digital assets that are being sold. We're talking about bingo cards. Uh, we're talking about commercial bingos. We're, we're, we're talking about calendars. We're talking about odds. We're talking about custom graphics on, on t-shirts, on sweatshirts, a video invitation. There are so many different ways where you can make a buck from the Super Bowl. It's crazy. Now, if you are terrible at design, uh, Canva, Canva Pro, which is the link in the description, does all the work for you. You just essentially just plug and play uh, whatever whatever words or whatever pictures that you want. And they already have like an awesome de design set up. So link in the description, definitely check that out. But yeah, you can sell digital uh, assets on Etsy, specifically designed around the Super Bowl. All right, now the fifth way where you can make money off of the Super Bowl is to off pet services. Now you can uh, do pet sitting, 
Uh, you could walk people's dogs. You could just show up and feed them. You could bathe it. Like you could do anything surrounding pet services. Kind of like with the cleaning service, people are gonna be super busy and out and about on the Super Bowl and their dogs are gonna need some love. So when this happens, they hire out people to walk their dog, to clean up after their dog, to let them out, to feed them. Uh, to pet sit, all of that, all of the above. Now you can go through websites like, like WAG, like Rover, or you can just like with the cleaning services, be freelance and offer your services to anyone that you want. And you could go through Google AdWords, uh, you can go through TikTok, you may some viral TikToks and send it out to people just in your area. You could do postcards, you could, you could do anything. You could do absolutely anything to get the word out, but you gotta start right now. All right, and then the sixth way where you can make money off of the Super Bowl is gamble. Now this one's the most obvious and there are so many different opportunities out there right now. As far as gambling, uh, whether it's fantasy, whether it's pick'ems, uh, whether it's private games with friends, uh, there are so many different opportunities to gamble and not just gamble on the game, but gamble on everything. Like what, like what color t-shirt is Rihanna gonna wear? What's the first song she's gonna sing? Is the coin toss gonna be heads or tails? There's a lot of fun stuff that just doesn't really have anything to do with football, but you can still bet on it. So the sixth way, if you're good, you can make up to $10,000 gambling on the Super Bowl. Personally, for me, I use DraftKings. I'll throw a link in the description so you can check it out. All right, that's, uh, that's it. Those are my six ways on how you can make up to $10,000 within 24 hours surrounding the Super Bowl. Now, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.